goddamn individual Since the self makes me indivisible With a flow that's so irresistible And I've been running this like an elliptical And immiscible with my physical Habitual is inexplicable guys welcome back to half big hair reviews once again i'm here for my third review today and i think this will be my last one for today because i've been going back to back so this is one i've seen a good amount of reviews on but i wanted to pick it up just because it's really cute and i haven't tried any pre-baited units yet so this is the outre perfect hand line iba or iba i don't know how to say it um 13 by 6 lace wig with the pre-braided style um, it says it has baby hairs included. I've seen a couple reviews on this and the girls that have done the reviews on it have made it look really cute. So I'm hoping that I can do it some sort of justice. So here's what the stock card's looking like. Let's open it up and see what it looks like. So straight out of the box, this is what Eva looks like. These are really pretty curls. It's pretty long, especially in comparison to all the other ones I've done. Um, I feel like a lot of the ones I've reviewed have gone to like about my boobs and then the back, just below my bra. But this one seems much, much longer than that. So here's the braid. and the baby hairs this one doesn't seem like you'd have to go crazy with the baby hairs since it's already pre-braided so i'm gonna put it on and um cut off the lace see what it's looking like and then i'll come right back and see if we can make this work out that it doesn't come with a ridiculous amount of baby hair so you can kind of just swoop it to how you like it and it's not overwhelming at all it gives it more of a natural look this is probably one of my favorite units that I've reviewed and these braids come in a little ponytail already so you don't really have to worry about them unraveling and you do have this space underneath here free to part but i honestly just i wouldn't take them out um because if I, I feel like if i'm getting a unit for a certain style there's no point in me taking it out because not only is it gonna mess the hair up but i don't know how to braid onto the scalp so it'd be like i wouldn't be able to get that style back i'm getting some tangling probably more tangling than shedding um it's not too crazy i like that this isn't very thick like it has that look but it's not super thick at all 
it's definitely a good density the texture is I'm gonna lean more towards soft yaki just because it's not it's not silky at all um It lays flat. It's not like you have to go in and um, with a wand tool or a flat iron and flatten it down. Like, look at that. It's laying flat. I would have went with like I guess a brighter color, like a maybe number two. This is a one B, um, but this is one of the only ones they had, and I wanted to try it, so I figured I'd get it anyway. But I still like it regardless. This comes all the way down. This is my belly button. This hair comes past my belly button. Um, but the fact that it thins out at the bottom gives it more of a natural look, which I like. This is all the hair to the front. And this is to the side. And this is to the back. I'm trying to step back some so you could see how long it is. It's pretty long. Um, which isn't anything crazy to me because I'm used to wearing long units. But I probably would, uh, I feel like I may, um, if I were going to wear it, I'd probably wear it as it is um, a couple times. And then probably go through and start uh, trimming it down a little bit. Just because it's so pretty, it makes you not, like, it's so pretty. It makes you not really want to mess with it. Like, they honestly did a really good job with this one. I would 100% get it again. I'd get it in. <laughs> I wish they had it in, like, um, like a DR30 or S1B30 or F1B30. Um, but I would get it in, I'd get it in, like, a 2. I don't know if they have a 4, but I'd get it in a 4. But yeah, I feel like even the people who've done this, I mean, they, I honestly feel like they've done it more justice than I have because I've kind of just been giving run throughs and just kind of slapping it on and trying to see what it'll look like. Um, I could put more work into it, but I feel like, look at this. Doesn't super need it, but yeah, it's definitely cute. So that's pretty much it. This is my last review for the day. I'm um, gonna give myself a little break. I don't really have much else to say about it besides the fact that I love it. Definitely way more pros and cons. Um, I mean, I can't really think of any cons because just like I said, with any unit, it's gonna tangle, it's gonna shed. Um, this isn't crazy either way, um, but I really like the style. It's different and cute and free. It kind of gives like those hippie vibes. So that's all I have to say about this unit. So this is Miss Eva. If you like this, uh, just let me know what you think about it. If you like it, if you don't, um, if there's anything I should do different, if you have any tips. Um, other than that, have a good day. Thank you for tuning into my channel. Bye.